G'day, this is Oz Echo playing FTL Advanced and starting a new one with the uh, Mantis Cruiser Type B. So the position we're in at the moment, unlocked all the A ships, unlocked all the B ships, so we're working our way through them. As we do that, we're unlocking the C ships, except for the ones that don't have a Type C. So basically, going to work our way from right to left now. So the Mantis Cruiser Type B, what I'm looking forward to with this one is the giant um, teleporting room where I can do four at a time, as well as starting with a boarding drone. So it's a pity you only have two crewmen and one of them should stay as the pilot. It doesn't have to, it can actually send him away, but then of course your ship loses all dodge without autopilot. So yeah, it's going to be a bit of a boarding mission kind of thing. So the ship is going to be called the boarding pass and let's just jump into it. All right, we will go, I think up through the top. Looks like a better way to go this time. Got no weapons though. So that's the other thing. <laughs> uh, want to buy a weapon to start with. Got decent shields. So I mean, boarding is going to be the thing, especially in the early game. All right, and especially well-armed pirate ship approaches you. Hand over one of your crew members and the rest of you can go unharmed. Well, you can just nick off, mate. Definitely gonna throw the boarding drone out and got 15 dodge. Well, depends if that can actually get through both of these so for that one to do damage. We'll just send the one guy over. All right, teleporting to his pilot. Uh, be a pretty even fight there, I think. We're going to take out his oxygen. Got a defense drone as well. So I'm going to shoot down missiles, but it would definitely be handy. So you're going to want to get uh, this upgraded pretty fast. Now, don't have a clone bay yet, so I'm going to have to bring this guy home. And we'll definitely do that now. Get him nice and healthy. He's done his job. Now, pretty much, we just wait for this guy to kill everything in there. Which doesn't take long. And we get Ian. So it appears the slaves did not survive the fighting. I think they did. Uh, you find their burnt bodies in the hold, but before you strip the ship, you hear faint noises in the walls. You break off a latch, and a slave falls out of a hidden compartment coffin. Once recomposed, the slave offers to join your crew. Just gonna... Take his word that he was a slave, not one of the enemy. All right. But Mantis, perfect. So we really need a clone base. First thing we're going to want to buy. And first thing we're going to upgrade is the uh, drones to get the defense drone in. Because taking damage from missiles will not be good considering we can't actually fire on his uh, weapons bay. So that'll cost 75 plus power. 125. Or just work on dodging. Alright. Let's go up to the nebula. I think this is definitely going to be one of the harder layouts when we get to the uh, harder difficulties as well. Alright. Distress call. Try to dislodge it. Awesome. Uh, I don't want to go to the store straight away. So yeah, the uh, achievements for the Mantis we've already got, so I'm not worrying about that. We're just trying to unlock the C-Type and defeat the Rebel flagship on this run. Uh, you receive a hail from a station orbiting nearby planet. Captain, we have Federation Terraforming Team C-12 are in need of assistance. Do you have some time? Yeah, of course we do. I will scan the planet. And yeah, whatever. And uh, alright, pirates. So, boarding drone and teleport two guys in now which we'll do to his weapons. I guess always a good place to start. Fighting humans, that's good. And the Mantis there, isn't it? Yeah. Boarding drone will mop up any survivors, though there shouldn't be any. No more life signs already. Could have saved the drone part. All right, come back and heal. Waiting. Is 
So faster med bow might be a good idea too. Right. Oop, there you go. Forgot to save the spots. Alright, those are your positions. And I won't go to store yet. Might be a chance to get a cloak. That would be nice. Okay. Okay. Let's just keep throwing warding drones out. You go to... Go to the pilot because I know there's a guy in there. You got a few shots, two on one. There we go. And a human again. And a third guy. So it's a good thing the boarding drone was there. Oxygen slowly leaving the room. Those guys are good. And there we go. Absolutely killing them. I wonder if the drone recovery arm actually recovers these drones or not. Don't know. Alright. He can jump over to there. So we can go here first and then do a bit of a spiral. Get Dangler all healed up. Dangler did great on one of the other playthroughs. Uh, I think it was a human then. Can't remember now. Fuel for drone parts. Fuel's looking okay now, but I'm sure we'll get low on it later, so I'll say no to that. Okay, what are we going for? Drone recovery arm. Non-destroyed drones will be retrieved when jumping, so we'll go for that. It'll give us defense drones back, even if it doesn't give the boarding back. And as for weapons... Hmm... Guess we need to do damage. So ions are useless. The bomb we could send onto our weapons. We will do crew damage, which can help out with our boarding parties. System damage. Hmm. Might go for it, but getting more crew now will be more helpful, I think. Getting um Getting them in early so that they can get the experience. Well, we'll go for a human because, as it says, skills improve slightly faster. And then can we still afford... Not quite. Backup battery we will need later on in the game though. So, quite happy with that. Now, this mantis is going down here. The human can take over there. Not losing much there. One out of 15. This guy... Yeah, that's absolutely fine. So, save those positions and jump out here. Start working towards the exit. Alright, we'll fight the ship. Why not? So, boarding drone. Teleport three guys into his weapons bay because he's got this bomb. And we should be able to make short work of them. Three on two. Three on one. There we go. And another human. Awesome. Come back, guys. And this human will get even more dodge for us from there. There we go. Alright, save those spots. And let's start jumping. Yeah. We can get out to there. We go down and up and around. Though, that'll run out of time. Won't try and get fancy because the rebels will catch up. Send an away party. Alright. Let's go. Oh, there's a quest there. So I guess we are going this way. Perhaps they were mistaken. Well, thanks for that, guys. Alright. Already missed the exit. So no reason not to do these two. Alright, do we need a boarding drone? Probably not. Let's just throw these guys into the biggest room so they all fit. And take down his mantis first. There we go. Three onto the Angie. Easy. 
can't recover them straight away because it's a uh, environmental hazard. So you get stuck waiting around. All right, there you go up there. Wait for the FTL. The flare will just hit. All right. No rush now then. Okay, make sure the teleport is ready when we go. Alright, going down here. We'll fight the ship. Don't need to scout, don't need to delay them, obviously. Alright. So, no boarding drone. Let's jump in here again. Same fight as the last one. Mantis dead first, and then he's straight after. Alright. Still haven't taken any damage yet. Crew is still doing good. Definitely need to get a clone bay. Don't want to start losing my mantises. Alright, back to your spots. And. Should we upgrade? I think some more dodge would be good, but we're gonna start taking borders on soon. So at least get the first doors in that. I think that should be good. Okay, what do we got? He's got a big old flak. So we'll jump into his weapons room. It's nice and big. Two humans, three humans. Let's even kill them all in one go. Alright. Yep. <laughs> Somebody else on his ship. Probably the pilot. Take his weapons out first. There we go. Somebody else there. Well, there he is, and this guy's going to die now. All right, get back in there. Oh, he's got a clone back. That explains it. Well, how are we going to do this? I think I'll bring him back. Get him healed up, because I don't want to lose any of them. While he's got no weapons, we'll just fix that for the hell of it. Alright, back down there. Teleport him in here. Kill him as quick as you can, and then destroy his clone bay. I think we'll go with a civilian sector. Don't like the idea of um, the environmental hazards in this playthrough. Might work in our favour because we've got no weapons anyway, but yeah. Alright, finish it up guys. And Shelton. Alright, who's hurt? Valeria. There we go. Alright, where can we go? In Nebula anyway. Let's just avoid it. Ah, uh, no. You can give me someone, that's fine. Let's go... In here first. It's gonna be nasty when he explodes. Probably get them back before that missile hits. Yep. 
Go heal up. And let's jump over here. And we'll do one of these. Okay, so they're not going in there. I'm going to have to do a boarding drone. Good first spot to go. Take out his only harmful weapon. Alright. These guys back. Now, I don't know how this is going to work with him not being able to get to the other rooms. Even then you wouldn't be able to do enough damage. You're going to have to wander between these two. Might just have to jump away from this one. Because I can't turn him off and on again. He just... Same drone. Um, don't want to teleport in. Because I think they'll die before it recharges to bring them back. Yeah, I'm just going to jump away. Alright, defend the outpost. Definitely. Take out your missile. We'll throw a boarding drone out. So I started with 14. I'll have to see if we get a boarding drone back at the end. Medbay. That's pretty uncool. Okay. The crew dead. Salvage what you can. And then get some more from them. Alright, you guys come back. Alright, heal up. Yeah, have to go through the store to get anywhere else that we want to go. It's fine. Scrap recovery arm would still be good this early in the game. Hmm. Oh, now you have it. <laughs> now, is that movement speed just in our ship? I think it is. Might want to sell it. And mind control would be good. Cloaking, not absolutely necessary. But mind control will be good. And it will get even better in the late game. Yeah. Final slot. Seriously? We got six. Alright. Um, do we want mind control or cloaking then? Well, we're going for a boarding focus. So we'll have to do mind control. Oop. Page one. Can't get anything. Well, could still get the small bomb if we wanted to. I think it would be a good idea to have missiles, but lasers would be even better just in case they get their um, super shields. So we'll leave that for now. Scrap recovery arm will be helpful though. So I'll sell that. Take on that one. Yep. Okay. Let's jump to it. Mm, take out his weapons, even though I don't think they can actually harm us. Let's take this guy. Four on one will be good. have to fight for that guy, there we go. And then kick his ass. Alright. Come back. In the med bay. FTL was nearly ready. There we go. And jump out there. Let's go to the store. 
then go visit the other ones, probably go back through the store again if we need to. Ah, uh, that's exactly what I was looking for. Five shots. 95. Not going to sell anything to get it though. Alright, so we have to get that. Okay, we need 95. Hmm. I think we'll put them in here. And then send this guy up here. Send boarding drone. Okay. Send the boarding drone over to take care of some things. While we're doing that, mind control him to slow things down and to kill that. Bring these guys home. Put them up there. All right, there goes the boarding uh, system repair drone. Guys are uh, upskilling nicely. Alright, go back. Now, take that out. Alright, as soon as that's destroyed. Scrap. Hmm. I had a couple other ones to visit, so as long as they're not all useless, distress call should definitely give a bit of scrap. Don't need much, and then we get an awesome weapon. Okay. Teleport to his pilot. And mind control his rock pilot. Cool. I'd say those are the only two people on board. to upgrade this to whatever we actually needed it. But, jump there right now. Now, four power, yep. So it'll be a while before we can use it, but one of the best weapons in the game. I reckon uh, Vulcan, and then Flak 2, and then Burst Laser 3 the order I put them in anyway. So what do we need? 40 just for the first one. But the first one gives us two power I guess. All right. So it's a hundred to get it up far enough to use the weapon. Okay. Jump here then the exit. Quite happy with that sector. You can have the missiles, yeah. Jump. Yeah, straight to the exit now. 
Okay. Hmm, Rebel Space Station and Single Fighter is monitoring this beacon for Federation activity. Number of civilian ships are docked, awaiting inspection by the Rebels and possible detainment if they are Federation loyalists. The Rebels haven't noticed you yet. We will. What happens if they release the civilians? Hmm. I don't care. I want to attack him. Alright. He's got a couple of lasers, so we better get his weapons out. And we will board to distract them and mind control the human. So it's basically four on two. Right, nice miss there. Three on one now that his mind control is over. There we go. Want to get another crew member? Get him in there. All right. Next sector will be rock controlled, and no choice of sector after that. So it makes absolutely no difference. Okay. What do we got? Go this way. Hide the ship. Sure. All right. Jump into his oxygen room and mind control the rock and then send this guy to weapons. I'm just gonna follow him over there. Okay. Send this guy out to help. Send this guy oh, in. Yeah, right. Send him there to do a bit of work on it. So we can nearly upgrade to the weapons already. Wow. Right, let's wait for the healing. Okay, now don't really need to worry about getting the weapons on yet. So what I will do instead is upgrade the teleporter and the med bay. Teleport is more important to keep on. Now I've got the med bay running full time. Alright, we can get out of there, so let's go down here. Attempt evasive maneuvers. Send someone out there to defuse it. They'd better not die. Ah, crap. Uh, always cut the blue one. <laughs> and we lost the human. Bastard. Weapon detonates, everything goes dark. The bridge illuminated by flames pouring from the hole. Your bomb disposal volunteers spinning off towards a nearby sun. You put out the fires and prepare to move on. Bastard. All right. At least it wasn't the pilot, I guess. I lost that. Uh, Mantis can't repair. Hmm. Get this done and out of the way. Bastards. He was so well upgraded too. He's given us an extra seven. Because the other guy was pretty much the same as stick. Alright. There's a store there. I'm trying enough scrap to get another crew member. And I need to start repairing too. Alright. Don't want his bombs to hit. But we're going to have to take out that clone bay before anything else. Send the boarding drone over and mine control. What's he got? A rock will do. Yep, take out his oxygen. Let's just bring these guys home as soon as we can. Start them repairing. Don't need to do any more damage. Ah. Not cool, dude. I forgot to see if we actually got the drone back. Seriously. And in the oxygen room. Oh, that is going to be a bastard to get out. 
because now the oxygen is actually being destroyed. And the mind control, so we can't get him now that he's in the right room. This is just going to keep hurting, I think. Unless we can very quickly kill him. Which doesn't look like it's going to happen. He's got no oxygen though, so he might take a bit more damage. And of course, our oxygen's just going downhill fast. Alright. Worst guys to send in there. Yeah, this is going to be terrible. Oxygen is always terrible, especially when you have to repair it. Mm. You run back there before it hits. Go there, go there, go there, go there. Seriously. Get the oxygen in and one back. Okay. Can get a bit more scrap, just don't have enough for a crewman yet. Crap. Well, do I have anything to sell? No. Alright. Look for a different store. Yes, we'll attack someone. Alright, now this one's gonna go better. <laughs> Weapons. Far out, clone bow. Clone bow first. Mind control him, take him to wherever he is so they can get weapons down faster. Alright, 14 drones. Gonna try and remember this time. Just in time, cool. Taking that out. Let's uh, send one down there. Alright. Return, return. So that was 14. Will it go back up when we jump? Must only be the outside drone here, but all right, no climb base. So we'll jump to his weapons and mind control the rock. Four on one. Can't hurt us now. So you don't have to dodge him. Hull beam. 
Okay. store around somewhere. Alright, I'll do the same thing again. Jump to his weapons, mind control, his guns, spare rock. There we go. Decent scrap from all this. Alright. I think we can jump to two more. It's gonna have to be the store, then the distress, and then the exit. Hmm. This would be perfect. Allows crew teleportation and mind control to work. Definitely going for that. And do we want Brian or do we want Frederick? Well, we don't have weapons yet, so let's go for 20% faster recharge, I guess. You go there. Save spots. Oop, while we're here. Definitely do that. It's got plenty of fuel, so we're doing good. Now, jump to distress, so we get to there. Jump to the exit, we'll get to there. So, can't do the extra one. Unfortunate. Hmm, try and rescue survivors. Awesome. Hey Jonesy, you are our engine man. Now, got one for that. So, we're needing to... Yeah, if you get the weapons, we need to get the extra uh, weapon... Uh, drones, that's the word. So we need 75. Dodge is going to be important too. Might get a bit more dodge first. Attack. Now, it's annoying because we can't send these guys in. But, boarding drone is going to do enough damage. So let's take that out. Good. So he's got no people on there to damage it, so it's just going to wander around destroying systems. Fix the breach before the oxygen's out of there. Get some evasion back. All these weapons down, so it doesn't matter. Alright, now the problem is, gonna have to wait for him to repair some of these so we can damage them again to do hull damage. So it's a hassle. And it'll probably take a long time. No point teleporting guys on there because now this guy's destroyed all three um, systems anyway. Just do some ship upgrades while we're waiting. Alright, well what I'm going to do is I'll finish this video here. I'll sit around a bit waiting for this to actually happen so it's not 10 videos of just watching this guy go from room to room destroying things, and I'll be back again soon. Thanks for watching.